What's up guys? This is Severin Stillsmith here. Um, so I got a new gig bag. I've been having gig bag issues trying to find a, a sturdy gig bag and I ended up with a mono case, I think M80 series. Here it is right here. Um, this is the this is a comparison as far as size wise to my ESP black hard shell case, the standard wooden one. Um, they're pretty comparable in size. Um, so it's not going to be a really small gig bag like sometimes you'll see. Um, but I have to say guys, this is the most, the best made gig bag I've ever, ever had the pleasure of owning. So uh, the outer shell is actually waterproof, which is really cool, and no, Mono is not paying me to say this. I purchased this gig bag at their um, sort of holiday half off sale, so I got this for about a little over 100 bucks plus some shipping, so it was a great deal. Um, but yeah, so this is waterproof outer, um, super, super stur sturdy stuff. I mean, you know, your typical gig bag will can probably tear really easily, but I think this is very sturdy. You have an outer pocket right here. Um, let's see if I can open this up. And this, the, uh, one of the weak points in gig bags I feel like are the zippers and these feel very heavy duty, which is great. Um, we have a pouch right in here. This is kind of cool because you can actually use this guy right here to wrap some cables with if you want to wrap your cable in there. Very neat. Got some pockets right in there and then the pouch, of course, right there. Come around the other side. Sorry, I'm filming this on my bed. It's kind of bobo, but we got to do what we got to do. It's good light in here. Let's take a look in here. We also have another pouch right by the headstock and place for picks. Maybe your name tag, um, you know, pins, what have you. And when we flip this guy over, um, we can see some really awesome shoulder straps, which are very convenient. Um, and you can lock these guys together right here. So if you want to carry it like that, you can. And another weak point in gig bags, I feel like, is the handle. And this is actually coming apart just because I don't have it zipped up right now. But the uh, handle is actually held on by steel rivets. Very awesome handle too. Alright guys, so let's look at the inside. Oh, I forgot to mention the bottom, we actually have rubber on the bottom and then these are some kind of anti-skid pads right here. There is uh, some padding and plastic around the bottom in the, of the guitar with a little space for the guitar end pin or the uh, strap button which is awesome. There's my, ES, or my Edwards Viper sitting in there. And then we have a really cool feature to hold the neck in place, like so. And you can actually put picks right in here, so that's pretty cool. I think there's actually some nice padding around the top as well. There is M80 series electric guitar gig bag. Some great padding on the sides. So, I mean, uh, just an overall, just a killer gig bag, guys. I highly recommend it if you can afford it. Um, this is the Monocase M80. Thanks for watching.